We're live in beautiful dripping springs on this fine day on historical Mercer Street. And we have a friend here. Good morning, John McIntosh. How are you today? We are going to talk all things beer because if you've ever been to Dripping, this is the place for it. We are at a very beautiful and unique place called Acapon Brewing. John, how the heck are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Thanks for joining us today. And I, for anyone who doesn't know, I mean, yeah, tell us all the things and give us, show us the things. Uh, all the things. We're an English brew pub. We started about five years ago. We make all of our beer on site here. Um, we've had a great time. We're coming up on our fifth anniversary in July. Um, we opened the barber shop, uh, Craft Beer Bar, 11 years ago, and we decided we wanted just to make more beer, so we opened this place too. John and I were just chatting, and for anyone who actually didn't know, dripping was dry, completely dry. What's the timeline? Oh, uh, early 2000s. So it's, it's been a pretty big change since then, now that we're home to several breweries, wineries, distilleries. A pretty big change, to say the least. Let's go ahead and step in. He's going to show us kind of the cellar now and yep. where all the magic happens. So we uh, do all the brewing outside, but this is the cellar where we, everything ferments and um, stays cold. Takes about three weeks to make a beer, you know, give or take, depending on the beer. Absolutely, and of course, it's dog friendly. I feel like you yep. have to be in Central Texas. You do. My business partner and I met at a Paws Benefit, so we're definitely dog friendly people. Yay! So. You fell in love with the dogs and you fell yep. in love with each other. We love that. And guys, this place is just so unique. It's kind of, what would you say, goth? Like, what, what's the vibe? It's a little dark. Um, <laughs> it has some darker, you know, we, we like gothic fiction, you know, so Frankenstein, um, you know, Dracula, things like that. We pull a lot of weird references for names and decor out of that. I kind of love it though. Why is this calming to me? Maybe that says something about me and my mental state. Uh, maybe. Um, you know, there's a lot of wood in here. We took a bunch of old fence pickets, made the walls, we made the tables, we made the chandeliers. You know, we tried to keep it, you know. Still cozy. Exactly. Kind of and y'all, look at this. This is the coolest part. So these are historical photos of Mercer Street back in the day. I just love old Texas photos. Like this just kind of highlights, I mean, he's got a great space here. And you have so much fun doing it too. So you and your partner, um, your friend kind of started this, yeah, years ago, oh, yeah. and yeah, this has been a blast. I mean, you know, if you're not having fun doing this, you're, you're doing, you need to be doing something else. It's right. a lot of hard work, but it's very rewarding. Absolutely, and although you know, you kind of see some of these different images here, but it really is also a family place. Kids are welcome, dogs are welcome. Oh yeah, everyone can come out. Yeah, we want everybody who walks in the door to feel welcome here, and that's the nice thing about dripping. We think we really succeeded with that. You know, old timers, newcomers, you name it. We're just Absolutely, and him and I were also just kind of chatting. Of course, stripping is known as like the gateway to the hill country, but it's people are stopping here, and for so many reasons, it's just beautiful. And, and I mean, beer, the delicious beer is one of them. You walk in here and you can just smell it. Thank you. <laughs> no, I think we're, it's really nice that dripping's changed from being kind of a pass through on the way to someplace else to being its own destination. I think that's huge. Yeah, I wish we could have beer right now, but I don't think it's legal. It is not. It's not. And John follows the rules, and that's why, you know, you got to love a guy that follows the rules. Yeah, that's, that's it. It makes a big difference. <laughs> and we so appreciate you waking up so early with us and talking. <laughs> I'm glad to do it. 